Welcome back, guys, to another uh, video with Brian Bolsh. All things keeping cryptocurrency and understanding the blockchain and Web 3.0 simple. Uh, someone uh, got back to me today and said, Oh, cryptocurrency and Bitcoin is just taken off and it's boom again. And I said, Are you sure? Are you sure that it's needed uh, for Bitcoin to go up and down, for the industry to keep uh, growing? Well, I wanted to re refer them to this uh, website from Newswatch, uh, recently released, and that was released well and truly before uh, Bitcoin started to take its uprise it's around over 20k right now, uh, the time of this video. But back at the release of this uh, article, uh, Bitcoin would have been sitting around 16,000. And it had been doing that for quite some time. And of course, a lot of people, you know, go through the motions and close the door and close their windows, close the blinds and think that nothing is happening in, in the crypto industry. Well from uh, the report of uh, news watch uh they are saying that there are five industries where crypto is currently booming right now so it's very important to watch out for the things that are booming and not necessarily the things that are booming you know what i mean guys so you don't have to close up shop you don't have to close your blinds you don't have to say good night to the world uh, there is always something going on in every industry. And uh, if you are part of the crypto industry, it's very important that you know this and not to be overshadowed by the gurus out there uh, trying to take you down a certain rabbit hole, so to speak. And uh, mind you, uh, for those who are Chinese, Nothing offensive against the year of the rabbit, all good. They say, okay, so they say that the industry today is the age of the aspect of the industry is one that has grown in huge proportions nowadays due to no small part or role played by the industry revolution. A huge turn in the society as we know it. And when you're looking into the concept of the industry today, we can see that it is plays a strong part in today's consumer orientated society as every little part of our lives is heavily affected by the aspect of industrial production guys that's it the beds we sleep in the clothes we wear even the appliances we get ready in the morning and breakfast we eat and the gear we use every day unless you live in a developing country somewhere like africa then of course there are a few more manual processes to that but uh, to most of us who are in the cryptocurrency world um you know we have had the machines of uh, washing machine and dishwashing machine and all these type of processes for some time now and so we the topic of finances is just one of those that's grown an incredible common in society this topic is another highly important area in our lives and uh, in particular the influence of all parts of lives and it's one that's become increasingly prevalent in our culture and because of the importance of the financial sector in all aspects of the individual lives as time goes on we are able to purchase everything we require with the help of financial aspects however in the event there are recessions and uh, that has been reported by many uh, uh, economists and uh, very uh, large uh, investment and corporations around the world that they're saying a recession is for 20 23 uh, that's not my words that's their words let's see 
not only are the finances are severely impacted, but so is our way of life. Concerning the realm of finances, one of the most significant developments in the industry at present time is the rise of cryptocurrency because it has been around for a long enough for the youngest to mature in teen from into the teenager even in calling to the trend would be a bit of a stretch to them this point in the last several years crypto has seen significant expansions in a variety of businesses in this post uh, they go on to that we'll discuss uh, some of the largest and most popular industries throughout the globe the make up the use of the element of cryptocurrency for most of us yes we're just uh, used to going to the coin bases of the binances and doing the trading and the swapping um, and of course uh, those who are more advanced become a little bit more gambling uh, not investor orientated of all so uh, you know uh, capitalized on uh, the uh, trend towards uh, um, you know saying that bitcoin will go up to 20 when it necessarily hasn't and there we have ftx type collapse because it didn't uh, you know people were hunger and first for that type of gambling no matter whether uh, the company is wrong right whatever there are people out there who want that and they go into the online gaming casino gamb gambling world. Uh, it is a, uh, one of the most uh, popular sectors in modern world. It operates uh, business strategies, basically focuses on developing itself and selecting some of the greatest technology and financial trends, using them to better itself and tap into new markets. It had been done noticeably during the era in which computers and IT has become a permanent landscape with software developers and casino providers flooding at the time of newly created uh, internet with new online casinos, online gambling sites. This occurred during the time when online casinos and online gambling sites were flooding the internet. The, the business strategy is one of the most successful for the online casino industry and now with this usage of cryptocurrency guys this is where it uh, comes into play as a mechanism one of, is able to make payments and new market have been tapped into the business model has been successful for online casino industry and if one takes the time to look into Bitcoin's uh, top uh, Bitcoin casinos, they will quickly discover <coughs> that the online <coughs> uh, casino business is discovering and penetrating new markets as a result of its ability to serve customers who have an interest in cryptocurrency alike. Uh, number two, that a lot of people have not considered is the entertainment industry by decentralizing video encoding storage uh, content delivery uh, blockchain technology uh, may be able to contribute to significant reduction in cost of video traffic uh, this has potential to revolutionize established participants in the video streaming ecosystem uh, such as Netflix, YouTubes, and uh, many of the online storage providers uh, for your data, uh, currently under threat, the Web.2 uh, versus the Web.3. Uh, the video coin system is already taking steps towards realizing the goal of realizing this wealth. A peer-to-peer -peer algorithmic market is provided by the decentralized network in order to provide cloud video 
infrastructure, which includes encoding, storage, distribution of content. It operates on new on a new blockchain, and customers rent these services using cryptocurrency called video coins. Another decentralized network which enables users to share live videos with their peers is called Live Peer. Uh, this network is developed on the Ethereum blockchain and by conducting video transcoding users have the opportunity to learn live peer, uh, earn live peer tokens. So, Guy, the world is uh, really uh, changing, and uh, at the moment, most of us have uh, learned the web 2.0. Uh, a lot of us are still not aware of uh, the transitioning of 3.0, other than uh, thinking it is uh, exchanging Bitcoin on uh, Binance Market or Coinbase. Or something like that. Okay, the third sector we'll look at is hotels and hospitality. To examine this further, let's look at the different sector of the hotel business, which, despite seemingly out of the place of nature, is being profoundly reshaped by the rise of cryptocurrency. Large hotel chains may find that the commission they pay for third-party booking agencies may eat up much of the 30% of their total revenue. Independent hotel chains, smaller hotel chains, often pay out between 20% to 22% of their revenue to third-party suppliers. The booking and selling procedure may become more efficient thanks to blockchain technology which enables hotels to keep a greater proportion of the money for themselves so you know we we're starting to see the the significant benefits of uh, blockchain cryptocurrency rather than just a uh, exchange uh, from fiat and hoping to create a profit uh, on the other end the proliferation of uh, cryptocurrencies has also uh, been beneficial for the hospitality industry in terms to mirrored uh, payment options available for vacationers. This is one of the more areas of the industry is seeing positive effects. The cutting end te technology has been used by cryptocurrency in the blockchain is being adapted by an increasing number of hotels, travel agencies, and the results of vacationers are now able to make purchases of goods and services at reduced costs and in a manner that is more protected. Uh, so this is really important for you who are travellers out there, uh, those who are in the tourism industry, um you know besides uh, uh needing to use cryptocurrency it has an underlying value an underlying uh, asset because of the shaping of technology has uh, beneficials to be able to increase uh, the aspects of profits besides uh, the the uh, you know the simple exchange value uh, the medicine and the, the vaccine distribution, because it offers a real insight into supply chain, blockchain uh, makes it possible to respond quickly to interruptions in supply goods, making it essential for technology to deliver vaccinations. Uh, during pandemic, this level of visibility will also helpful in determining which vaccination batches, if needed, to be recalled, the case adverse occurrences. Blockchain technology is already being utilised by governments in Singapore and Malaysia to confirm vaccination certificates. These governments are deploying 
businesses uh, deploying systems that track the precise vaccine batches of vials where are used by uh, for each person. The two nations have a goal on making their respective computer systems compatible with one another, which will allow the expediation of verification of documents carried by the citizen in either nation when they pass into the other. Uh, also, in the insurance world, a big industry that uh, per, uh, a lot of people uh, find it uh, uh, an un un unnecessary uh, evil to have. And finally, the industry sector is now one of the most active adopters of cryptocurrency, where everyone is familiar with insurances, which is one of the things that we pray we never have to use, but are relieved when uh, we have any hour. The majority of the c current uh, blockchain applications in the insurance sector aim to improve internal workflow instead of focusing on uh, product and development. And insurance firms are investigating how blockchain technology might improve efficiency, accelerate time to market, enhance the customer services they provide. Insurance businesses, will, for instance, may be able to drastically reduce processing time uh, cost by using blockchain technology to provide a single authoritative source for transactions between participants. Reinsurance, a insurance for insurers stand to benefit from the blockchain technology with PwC estimating savings up to 10 billion. In this industry, blockchain may be used to improve risk analysis, automate procedures, and speed it the claim settlement process. So yeah, as you've seen, guys, you've seen that the uh, blockchain cryptocurrency uh, has underlying effects in five huge industries in our world today that, that we rely on. Some final thoughts from the news watch when it comes to the use of cryptocurrencies in the modern times, one can unequivocally see that they're growing to be more than just a trend, uh, but rather a way of life for those who are looking to make payments in a secure, trusted manner, as well as letting its users exercise control over their funds this is something that can be seen when it comes to the use of cryptocurrencies in the modern times all of these different types of businesses have recognized the opportunities uh, that this presents and they are now using these opportunities to the fullest extent possible in order to maximize their profits and provide the greatest possible experiences for their consumers and clients guys i believe uh you're going to see huge advancements uh you, you've only got a a minor view picture view of uh of each of these industries from the entertainment hospitality uh hotel industry the online casino gambling and the medicine, the vaccination and distribution, the insurance world, and you're going to see uh, blockchain change every part of uh, e-commerce uh, moving forward, uh, helping to better uh, deliver value to clients. Um, you're going to see it uh, changing the music industry, and uh, as you see in the video world, it's uh, dr making gra drastic leaps forward. Uh, this this is going to increase, guys. Uh, whether a recession, we have a world recession. Um, it's more likely to grow even quicker uh, within a recessional time, as that allows uh, 
the corporations to not just cut back on their labour that's is seen as a negative and drastic uh, thing but it also helps them to also uh, invest into new technologies and new adaptions and uh, blockchain is one of those ways that things can be identified can be transparent and can be made public and that's what's important guys um, and and uh, particularly in the insurance field i know uh, a lot of you already know that there's a lot of fraud in that industry and any way that uh, we can make more things transparent uh, make more things clear avoid uh, the middleman uh, the better and uh, the easier going forward so we must see the positives out of the negatives of a recession and uh, and uh, and I hope everyone uh, is starting to see uh, cryptocurrency and the blockchain technology in a larger uh, viewpoint, seeing it as much more than uh, trading, seeing it as much more than making money, but uh, making things far more efficient, uh, bringing around savings, uh, helping us advance and also uh, helping uh, the environment at the same time in many ways uh, with uh, using this technology uh, helps to uh, translate in less energy in many fields. You guys, uh, have a great day. We look forward to connecting with you once again very soon. So take care, look after yourself. Please put a comment down below, uh, your thoughts, what you know about cryptocurrency, how you do feel about it moving forward, and your perspective. Uh, we greatly appreciate everyone, each one of you, and please go ahead and smash that bell, and make sure you go ahead and subscribe, so that you can get a broader understanding, heading further into 2023, how blockchain cryptocurrency and the web 3.0 is changing the landscape and creating a whole new landscape so to speak take care